Hey there guys, this is Flamsaron, aka YouTube's Tosuke, and this is my Dragon Ball GT Final Bout Commentary, and it's about friggin' time, too. This is the last of the Batoden games, in a way. And they're made by Bandai. But that's not all. This game was also the first Dragon Ball game, not including Dragon Power, which was heavily edited to be released in the US and this was before Funimation was around <laughs> or before they had the rights you can tell this game is pretty old And the Japanese version of the song's different. It's a song by uh, Hir Hironobu Kageyama. <clears throat> and although a lot of the characters are GT characters, they do have some Z versions. Like Vegeta's a Z character this time around. Which in my opinion makes more sense. But then we've got GT Trunks, who's one of my favorite versions of Trunks. Bam. We've got battle, tournament, build up, and options. I'm gonna take a look at the Capcom level. Make them easy because I'm not good at this game. Off. Off, because I don't want the game to, to mess with me. I'm looking at the recorder and it's lagging a little bit, so I apologize for the overall video lags. And if the final project's too much, I'll just redo it, you know? Let's take a look at the people we got. Goku, Pan, Kid Goku, Trunks, Vegeta, Gohan, Cell, Kid Buu, Frieza, and Piccolo. Now, keep in mind, this game was released in English before Funimation had the rights, so the voices are actually very different. This is probably the voice cast we would have had if, like, Bandai Entertainment or, like, another California-based, uh, company got the rise of the series. But let's take a listen. You might recognize some of these characters if you're into anime. I'll just play as Goku for now, I guess. Pay attention. So, let's see how strong you are. You look strong. This should be a good fight. Sound familiar? Because it's not Sean Chamel. It's actually Steve Bloom. Now bear with me, I'm actually not that good at this game. That's about all I'm good for, it's the energy blasts. Contrast to Ultimate Battle 22, the special moves are actually really easy to pull off. This is sort of a pastime for me and my friends. Nick and I used to play this game a lot. So, 
just as I thought. You're great. Yes, voice is very different. Vegeta's is actually pretty good, in my personal opinion. So let's see how strong you are. And of course, Kid Goku sounds like friggin' Mythos or Carol from Tales. In this game, when you beat a new enemy, you actually get the, uh, like when you fight a secret fighter, you actually get that character. And this game is more reminiscent of, uh, it's kind of reminiscent of the first one where there are two cheat codes to get all the characters and this game has the regular characters and Super Saiyan. It's also the first the first 3D Dragon Ball game and it's to be honest, kind of terrible. Yes, I am going to just spam Kamehameha over and over. I keep pressing back thinking that it's blocked when this game it's X. But in this game, there's actually another Goku, which is the Dragon Ball Z Goku. Now, the reason why I turned off Demo and Meteor off is because in this game, they are such a pain. Like, once it happens, this game is, like, kind of brutal. If anyone's actually good at this game, I so, freaking commend them. Because this game is kind of a pain. You look strong. This should be a good fight. You should know more than anyone else that you can't defeat me. Surprisingly, that's not Kyle Abair. I know it sounds a lot like him, or at least to me it does. That's actually Lex Lang. Who we know as uh, that one guy from Scribe. Of course, it's also Gohan we've got here. I actually do know some of the moves. Sorry if you guys can't really hear me that well. I'm kind of the mic sort of in a weird position, I guess. You're not as strong as you said. Yay. You look strong. This should be a good fight. You're going to give it all you got from the start, huh? I'm not so easy. Apparently Trunks' voice actor in this game is the same guy as Mike Guy from Naruto. Supposedly. It's not so hard once you turn the difficulty down, but still, you know, in Ultimate Battle 22, the game was hard, yeah, because, and the moves were hard to do, but the game was at least playable. I still use my kick move. You can fly in this game, but I don't really do it.
take that, son. So, just as I thought, you're great! Oh, hello. You look strong. This should be a good fight. This is going to be a problem. See, Trunks is a little upset because he's scared because I just beat the crap out of him and I beat him up so bad that he got knocked out of Super Saiyan. Trunks is actually a pretty good character to use in this game because he's... He, he moves pretty quickly. I think Goku's also pretty useful because you can just keep doing that. So, just as I thought, you're great! Honestly, I don't think Steve Bloom was a good choice for Goku. I can't really think of who else Goku could be. So, let's see how strong you are! Alright, I have to give him all I've got from the start. Fighting myself. Where's all my moves? Let's keep doing this. Take that. So, just as I thought, you're great. Real fun game, ain't it? You look strong. This should be a good fight. For all we know, they probably didn't even dub Majin Buu. this while I'm also trying to make the uh, watch out video it's being a pain awesome it hit him and now I'm in the sky You can kind of just fly all over the place. So, just as I thought, you're great. Guys, we're gonna have to kind of cut it a close here. We'll at least see who the. Oh. You look strong. This should be a good fight. Oh well. You're gonna give it all you got from the start. I'll see you guys later. I'm not so easy. Or well, yeah. <laughs>